this eraser. Oh my lord, have mercy. These are so funny to me. Like, I understand, like, why they're shaped the way they are for, like, our hearing and all that, but I feel like they are just, uh, like, they are just funny looking. And I think pinky toes are hilarious looking, too. Yes, yes. So, how do I know Amy and Brad? I know them because when I was little, I would go to church with one of my best friends ever, whom I miss like crazy, named Kelly Ward, and uh, I would go to church with her, and Amy went to that church, and she was such an inspiration to me. Like, I always wanted to be just like her. I wanted to look like her. I wanted to just, and she was, and she still is a great role model to have. She really is, like, for all ages, for everybody. For old people, young people, anyone. Because she's just a good person. I'm not just saying that she's my friend. She's very tolerant. It's hard to find tolerant people in this day and age. Well, what am I saying? It's always been like that with people. Always, always. always are hard for me, like they, to me, are just funny. No matter how I make teeth, they always look funny to me. I've got that, um, the Gladiator soundtrack in my head, and I really don't know why, so I haven't listened to it in a while. It's like hard for me to do facial hair. Oh, Brad has, uh, Brad has baby cheeks, I see. Brad has baby cheeks. He and his sister, Kelly, look so much alike to me. Self while I'm drawing. I only went to high school for one day, and I don't want to talk about that right now. Why? Um, let's just say it was a good thing, probably, but that was it. And uh, I always wonder what it would have been like if I had taken art classes or something. Like, I still need to learn so much because I, I don't know where to start. I don't know the proper ways and I know I, I could be doing so much better than what I'm doing and see like even on the ear like um the detail to me always looks kind of funny when I get too detailed so I just kind of leave it like I just kind of just leave it I hope this is showing up for y'all you know the lighting in here is not very good so this is but yeah um Amy I was actually gonna name my puppy Amy, but my husband was like, no, he did not like that for some reason. I, I, just, lo I just love, every Amy I've ever known has been really sweet too. So like, I was like, why not? Buttons, say the buttons. Plaid. Sweetie. 
Sophie feels weird calling another girl sweetie, like I'm being serious. It sounds like I'm being sarcastic. Yeah, sweetie, it's fine. <laughs> no. And here's the plaid. His plaid shirt. Amy's little finger is on top of it. So, I have some friends who truly do have like British, English, whatever accents, and so I like, always feel embarrassed. That's Amy's hand, by the way. I don't know if, I hope you can even see this. That is, that's Amy's hand that you're seeing on the picture right there. And let's see, I gave him some Bieber hair. So now let's get to Amy. Now let's get to Amy. I did her chin a little too pointy. Whatever. And then she has on a scarf. But... It's like bunched out. But yeah, whenever I, I look through her photos, I just have nothing but great memories. It's funny because like um, one of her brothers I actually had a little crush on for a while. Not anymore, obviously, but I was really young. And um, I still remember when he, one day we were all sitting down and uh, it, was, it must have been hot outside. I mean, it was down south. So, and he told me that just out of the blue, because none of us had shoes on, he's like, your toes are the ugliest toes I've ever seen and I was and I wanted to cry and I was like really why what's ugly about them and he was like because they like are little and then they like get huge at the ends and like so now whenever I look at my toes that's like that's like all I think of is like when he said that about my toes <laughs> and um he probably didn't like mean it to come out as me I mean he was just a young boy but like, I, I remember that because uh I had never really paid attention to my toes. Amy has such a beautiful natural eyebrow arch, good lord. It's just like a cat. And then she's got these piercing blue eyes. I don't like seeing piercings, that's cliche. But um, she really does. Because they're like the clear kind of blue-ish. They have like many other colors in them. It's funny though, whenever I meet people, they always, like every time I'm like, what color's your eye? They like are always like, well, they're this color, but then when I'm in certain moods, they change to this and that, and da 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 da. -da. Like everybody says that. It's kind of funny. Like I'm just waiting for the for when I ask somebody if their color eyes are, I'm just waiting for them to say that. Sorry, y'all. This is actually taking longer than I thought it would. But you know, I'm not one of these people who says that I I do speed drawings because that would just be a big fib. So. But yeah, Amy is such a tolerant person. Um, she, to me, exemplifies patience and love and all those great things. That's why I wanted to draw her because she's somebody I've known for a long time. And uh, although we never really got like super close, I, I knew enough of her to know that um, she was a genuine person. She didn't, there was, there was no like, agenda for her tolerating me or whatever. I mean, she's just a good person. And she's had many, if she wanted, you know, she's had chances to, to just rid me from her life, but she hasn't. What am I talking about? When I draw, it's like, I don't even know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I mean that, that sounded bad. I'm not, I know what I'm talking about. Like, I'm not lying, but I'm just saying like, I ramble and I already have a bad habit of doing that anyway. So when I draw, it's just like enhanced. I wanna, in, I want to 
emphasize her smile because uh, I feel like I feel like I didn't really there that's more like Amy now that's more of her smile before it was just kind of like before it was kind of like a grumpy smile now it's actually more like an Amy smile with sunshine and bunnies there. And let's see. Uh -huh. I don't think I'm going to shade it or anything when I'm done because I feel like it's just going to take too long. Well, maybe not. Actually, her hair needs to come out a little more too. She's got, she's got a lot of hair, y'all. She's always had, well, I don't want to be inappropriate, but she has a very pretty figure, so I actually need to draw boobs for her. If it was for me, I wouldn't really uh, even need to draw boobs on myself. But yeah, I made her shoulders, like, way too broad. Like, she's not got big, broad shoulders. What am I doing? And, yeah. Um, I don't like how I did the bottom of her scarf. I feel like it's just too much detail when it's not really necessary, so... I'm actually just going to pretend that her scarf's not bunched up like it is in the picture. And I'm just going to make her arm come out like it is. She's actually holding his hand. Hands are always been hard for me to draw. They really have. And then there's the rest of her hair cascading down. Oops. it's cascading all the way down onto his shirt and uh, her scarf Oof. her scarf is also fluffed out on his scarf I mean on his I really need to color this so I can actually like distinguish uh, so I can actually distinguish what's what because it's kind of hard to tell from just looking at this you know all right and then he's got the shading that meant to have and her arms coming right up under his neck She's got like a cute little, she has the cutest, always like accessories and makeup styles and here's a cute little, actually her watch is more square, so my bad. And yeah. Not wrinkles. It doesn't sound right. Um, I'm not really happy with how I've done Brad's eyes. I feel like it make, he looks like a toy. Like he doesn't look human. So I'm not happy about that. Alright, so... Um, on the mouth area, I think that's where I'm not really happy with how I did Brad. There, that's better. There we go. And eyelids. And what? Else? Just I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna just hair. It's quite a bit darker than how I have it looking on here. So we're just gonna make sure that it looks a little, because she's very blonde in this picture, so I want his hair to, in contrast, look darker. And I'm going 
going to actually, I said I wasn't going to do shading, but just to uh, really, I'm just going to do it on the hair because um, I want to do highlights for Amy. So we're just going to shade that and then I'm going to, we're going to shade his a little bit. And then I'm just going to give her some highlights. Ooh. Now her hair is highlighted professionally by Rachel. And then the root area is a little darker. Or maybe it's just shadow. I'm not sure. Can't really tell. Anyway, okay. So, yeah. Um, I need to color this because then it will look a lot better. But here we go. Oops, I put the beer over Amy. Ah. Amy with heart. And Brad. Here, so now I will just hold it up. Amy and Brad, the cutest couple ever. See, that's the picture I was looking at. There they are. All right, I'm done. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching.